L-sit to stand on P-bars. The L-sit to stand is a movement we can use to build straight arm pressing strength. If you're working towards a stall to press or even a handstand press, the L-sit to stand will be a helpful exercise. Okay, this is an L-sit to stand on the P-bars. Obviously the higher the P-bars, the easier this is gonna be. If you use a lower set of P-bars, then it's gonna be a lot harder in terms of the core compression. So, I'll demonstrate. So we're starting in our L-sit, legs are straight, toes are pointed, and what we're trying to do from here is to keep the arms straight, lean the shoulders forward, and obviously come into a standing position. So it's a lot of straight arm strength that we're using in this exercise. So if I go again, straight arms pushing down, shoulders are depressed, so really pushing down with the shoulders. We come into the L-sit, then from here we're pushing down, pushing down, leaning the shoulders forward, and pushing until we get to that standing position. Just a quick recap of the main points. We want to set the P-bars to be shoulder width apart. When we grip the P-bars, we focus on straightening the arms. We can depress the shoulders and twist the hands into the P-bars towards the pinky fingers to create external shoulder rotation, which will help to keep the elbows locked. At no point during the exercise should the elbows bend. We then move into the L-sit with the legs straight, the toes pointed and the shoulders depressed and slightly protracted. From here, we lean the shoulders forward as we maintain the core compression and allow the feet to slowly pass back between the arms. We're using straight arm pushing strength to help lift the hips up and move the feet back behind the hands. The goal is to place the feet on the floor behind the vertical alignment of the hands. I would typically do this movement for reps, but only the concentric phase. We do a rep, rest five to 10 seconds, reset, and then do another rep. We continue until we complete the prescribed number of reps. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe to the channel.